some way, somehow, with the help of God, I'm going to make it happen. Repeat after me, please. No matter how bad it is, or how bad it gets, I'm going to make it. I'm going to make it. Shake somebody's hand on your right and left and say, you got the right stuff. So yes, it's possible for you to live your dream. It's necessary that you associate with winners, that you work your system, that you are relentless, that you never give up. It's you, you've got to take personal responsibility. You've got to make it your personal business to make it happen. And you've got to resolve within yourself that I can do this, that it's hard. But you've got to say, I'm the one. I'm the one to make this happen. I'm the one to become successful in this business. As you work to help other people to become successful, that feeds your success. But you know it's going to be hard, but find out what will make it worth it for you. I told Mr. Washington I wanted to become a disc jockey. Someone asked me to tell this story. And he said, Les Brown, he said, if you want to do anything worthwhile in life, you've got to be hungry. And so I started working to develop myself. He said, I want you to practice every day being a disc jockey. I said, but I don't have any job now. He said, it doesn't matter. He said that it's better to be prepared for an opportunity and not have one than to have an opportunity and not be prepared. He said, most people are so negative, they will have to say no seven times before they say yes. If you want to make your dream become reality, the people that are running at their dreams know that it's possible that you can live your dream. That it's necessary, that you're relentless, that you have a plan of action, that you are creative. The people that are living their dream of finding winners to attach themselves to. The people that are living their dreams are the people that know that it's, if it's going to happen, it's up to them. And they're resolving within themselves, it's not over until I win. The people that are running after their dream know they're going to have hard times. They keep on running because they're saying within themselves, I'm the one, I'm the one. No matter how bad it is or how bad it gets, I'm going to make it. The people that are running after their dreams are the people that are hungry. Shake somebody's hand on your right and left and say, you got to be hungry. That if you want a thing bad enough to go out and fight for it, to work day and night for it, to give up your time, your peace, and your sleep for it. If all that you dream and scheme is about it, and life seems useless and worthless without it, and if you gladly sweat for it and fret for it and plan for it, and lose all your terror of the opposition for it, and if you simply go after that thing that you want with all of your capacity, strength and sagacity, faith, hope and confidence, and stern pertinacity, if neither cold poverty, famish or gulf, sickness or pain or body and brain can keep you away from the thing that you want, if dogged and grim you besiege and beset it, with the help of God you'll get it.